Hey everyone, this is Kathleen over at Book Brush, hopping in today to share one of my favorite time savers, creating one graphic and then using it across several platforms with just a few clicks of the mouse. Do you like saving time? Because I definitely do. So let's hop in and take a look. All right, let's take a look. We'll jump into Custom Creator and we'll choose a community template. I'm going to start with vertical. So under platform on the left, I will choose Pinterest. When you see one you like, you click on that. Now this video is how to use this same graphic with the same elements across multiple platforms. So here's your vertical version. If you like how it looks, you can go ahead and save changes, which will save it in your account. You'll go ahead and download and you can download as PNG, JPEG, or PDF. Once you've made the vertical version and you want to use this same look and feel across multiple platforms, navigate to the left and I'll show you how to make the square. Click on Instagram, choose the Instagram square size, and then you're going to rearrange within this new space. One of my favorite book brush hacks on the right hand side is the eye icon. So that lets you see what's inside and outside the workspace. That is super helpful when you are making one graphic and then editing and adjusting it with just a few clicks so you have all the sizes. You can resize your background either by dragging or double click and resize with a slider. Reposition if you like to. And then go element by element. So we'll take our crime scene tape, get a little larger, move it around. Take our book, resize if you want to, with either the slider or one of my favorites, hold shift and drag, and it will resize in proportion. So make that as large as you want to here. And then with the text, you may want to increase the size of each one. If it word wraps, just make your text box larger. And same thing with reveal, we'll increase the size. Position those how you like. You'll probably want to turn your eye icon back off just so you can see how it looks. And here's your square size. So go ahead and click download and download that version. And then let's also make a Facebook size. Click back to the left for add size. Choose Facebook. And again, use your eye icon here in the lower right. Resize. Now this one I'm going to scoot up because I really like that shattered glass. Crime scene tape. I am grabbing it by the side. You can also double click and resize with the slider. Move your book template, resize if you want to. And then with the text, we will increase both of those. And here is our awesome horizontal version as well. Head and download that one. So this is one of my favorite time saving hacks. Start with one graphic, whichever size you start with. We started with vertical. Then make it whichever other size. You can quickly pivot to square, horizontal, download each of those, and put this all over social media where it stays on brand for you. If you've tried this, let us know in the comments. 